much like the staff that we had for last act, it gets you to the boss in a way. Uh, the, what what uh, Columns Flow does, it opens up uh, the last little area for you. Um, but yeah. So let's kind of squeeze our way through here. What's going on? What's going on? So... Stop walking. Take out these poison centers. So yeah, I pretty much one or two hit, uh, depending on how lucky I roll. Uh, I have a pretty wide range of damage, like 50 to uh, what? What is? What is it? Uh, 69 to 129. So on average, I'm doing like 79 damage, 89, 70 to 85, 79 to 85 damage. I would say is a good is a good safe uh, safe bet. Poison Shrine, I can actually use that, so I'm gonna take it after I kill these guys, which then it'll be void, I won't need it anymore. I'm out of mana. Do I have any mana potions? No, I don't. I'm gonna have to start building for mana. I have a feeling that I'm gonna have to start doing that. I. Hmm. I wonder if there's a rune that gives you mana steal. Uh, and I'll give. My current item actually has health steal. There's a mana potion, that's cool. That's actually what I needed. Use that. Flail, don't need it. I think this is the first time you can actually find a flail, so this is this is actually um, not that bad. A flawed amethyst, man. I'm picking up gems like they're candy. Uh, spear, healing potion, healing potion, healing potion, healing potion. I actually need to make a trip downtown. Making my way downtown, walking fast, strangers. Identify, identified my items. Now let's go to Or Ormus because he's the closest. And sell the key. Don't need that. It's just one or two. Don't need it. Don't need it. Uh, want it? Want it? Don't. Don't need it. Don't need it. Um, I can pretty much sell all of these. All of these. All. Buy better potions. Really don't need to be doing that because, you know, I do pretty good. I do pretty good. Um, I have pretty low mana, so like a smaller health potion would would actually suffice. Let's make a uh, let's make an amethyst. So we have another completed item, and now we have. Oh, didn't mean to do that. I'm working too fast right now. So, we have a completed amethyst and another flawed emerald. So, I'm going to put these all over here. We almost have a full ruby. Um, so, yeah, that's, that's the whole deal. I'm waiting for that skull. I kind of want to put the skull in here because it gives you uh, stolen mana and life per hit. And uh, right now, that's just, it's like useless, because I'd only be stealing like, what, what do I do? I do, I'd only be stealing like three mana per hit. Which actually, I mean, when you think about it, it's not too bad, because my fire claws deals four, four, takes four mana. But, I mean, at the same time, you know, is it really worth it to just, you know, waste a skull right now? Or should I wait to you know, upgrade my skull and get better mana regeneration, you know. So I, at that at that with that thought in mind, I'm gonna wait. You know, skulls drop pretty much almost as often as emeralds do and, and in my experience emeralds are like the most common gems. That may not be true, but you know, that's just how I feel. So I'm just gonna take out this horde real quick. I see that chest over there. I just wanna make sure I'm safe and looting the chest, getting poisoned like holy shoot. Watch your language. That's another thing I'm trying to watch my language. If you guys m liked me cussing, I'm sorry, but I found out that I have younger people watching my videos, so I don't want their parents to walk by, and, and I've completely changed my thought process about this, but I don't want their parents to walk by and hear me go, mm, you know, just speaking obscenely something that you wouldn't want your children listening to at like five six years old uh, it's, I'm not saying that's the kids that's uh, that's the age of the kids that are watching my videos but you know people do have younger siblings I want to be a little bit of uh, oh grand charm is cool 
I want to be considerate of that. I don't want to be just, uh... I want my channel to be universally, uh, respected. So yeah, it was Column's Eye. We got Column's Eye. And that does nothing. It literally does nothing. So we're cool. We're done here. Let's just, uh, check our way out. And, uh, fill, uh, fill our thing up. Quest log. Now we have to go to Flare Dungeon. So we're going to the right place. We have to make our way through the place that we were at last time. But we'll do it. So, I mean, this this act isn't that bad. It's it's going by pretty fast. I'm I'm going to... Yeah, I think I'm just going to... I'm going to take off. I'm not going to even fight those guys. Don't need to. I feel well endowed with my... Uh, with my damage output. So let's just get out of here. I'm actually going to TP and then... T uh, and then take the waypoint back after I Hello. identify my items my items uh, put in Callum's eye Callum's Callum's I don't know 46 maximum stand I'll take it I'll keep it light radius 5% bonus attack rating what does this do 15 attack rating wanted dexterity fire resist poison resist damage reduced by 1 37 cold resist hmm is it worth it to be able to see more? Plus, uh, that's that's pretty nice. Let me check that out. If my attack rating... Let's change that. My attack rating is 49%. 5% of that is at least 20. And then you gotta add, like, 1 for 3. So it's like 23 plus 23 attack rating. 24. Wait, what am I thinking? 5% of 100 is 5. So 400. Yeah, okay, I was right. I'm I'm second guessing myself and it's not that good. I don't really need the ice resist, the cold resist here. The poison link could probably be a good thing, but I like to see in dungeons. So I'm going to keep that. The radius is nice. That had 7% of health stolen per hit, but no one can have it. Not even my dude. So, not even my mercenary, so it was just not worth it to keep it. And, uh, and that's, that's the way the cookie crumbles. So from here, let's, uh, make sure that we got everything we need. 46 stamina is gonna help a lot, because I like to run. Take a waypoint back to Spider Forest, go through the Great Marsh again, since we already know where it is. I'm pointing at my computer, but you can't see me. So, that was just retarded. Didn't need to do it. But we're gonna cross this bridge right here where my mouse is. There's a, there's a bridge. And then we're going to go all... Okay, I have to lead the way. But we're going to go through here. And then all the way through here, if you're following my mouse. And then through here. And then in there. And then we'll be in the Great Marsh. Good game. Sounds like a plan. Alright, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it to it. But something I should talk about. Brainstorm. Let's toggle that off so just walking through the forest you know just chilling just going for a stroll you know hope no I hope I don't get attacked by anything hmm I'm in the great marsh right now but I don't feel like it I need to feel like it you know I need to feel like I can run again if one of you guys if any of you guys actually can help me out I was looking it up and I can't find anywhere how much how many points I should put into care uh, to strength and dexterity before I can start putting into vitality and uh, and energy. That'd be great if you guys let me know because I know that I'm only putting into strength and de dexterity because I want to be able to put on the clothes, the clothes, the armor and all that stuff that that I get. Um, I want to be able to do all of that. I want to be wear be able to wear it all, and if I just get it out of the way. I can invest everything else in uh, into vitality and energy, and, uh, and trust me, it's oh god that hurts so much. I only did like half health. I think I just spammed like two potions because of that. But uh, yeah, because it takes longer to have to upgrade your strength and dexterity, so you're using like weak weak armor and stuff. But at this point, do I really need it? Do I need it? Like. I think I think I only need to put like 150 in each, but if you guys could like give me a like 
an estimate or tell me I'm right, tell me I'm wrong, it would be nice. A Nef rune. I what is that? Knockback. 30 defense. Oh, I'm going to die. I should probably not die. I should probably not do that. So, this, yeah, I have a, a my home adds 3 to Maul and 1 to Werebear. I have 10 into Werebear. So I get plus 90% of life, which is really good. I have 207 life. And uh, damage plus 120% and plus 75% defense. And that's pretty much as much as I'm going to put into there for a while. I'm going to get my Fire Claws to 5, and then I'm going to start putting in a Lycanthropy again. Let's pick up this and this. But, uh, but that... A locked chest. I'm glad I used locks. I mean, rings. I mean, keys. But I got a ring. That is the thing that I got, and that's probably why I said it. 93 gold, mana potion, mana potion, stamina potion. Let's, uh... Use this ring, Nefrun. Pretty good. Pretty good. I didn't read the, like, what it does to your defense. Like, I read it out loud, but I didn't really soak it in, you know? So, let's go back, because I feel like I missed the waypoint. I like to get all the waypoints. It's just something I like to do. And, uh, come here, Gloom. Or Gloom, or whatever you're, whatever you're called. Let's go back. Let's make our way back down to where this all started. Let's go down this bridge. I have a feeling that this bridge is going to lead me to good things. No, it isn't. It isn't. Is it? Okay, it might. I'm not completely sure yet. It's going to take a little while. 160 gold. Get your mana potion. That's pretty good. I like gold. Gold is good. I get to gamble more and get better items. I did not, however, I did not gamble for the items that I have. For the weapons that I have. Um, that is just all luck. So I'm going to use this stamina potion again. Can I get through this? Is there at least a chest in here? No, there isn't. Okay, let's leave. Bye. It's good talking to you. Good game. Later. Yeah, that was gay. I won't do that again. That was lame, not gay. Don't watch your language, James. Come on. Steel spell. Undead lightning enchanted. You guys know how much I hate lightning enchanted enemies. Oh, I'm not using fire claws. That would explain why I have a lot of, uh, a lot of mana potions. Key, because I use one, always want to refill on keys. I like to keep keys on me because of the loot. That is exactly the reason why I like to keep keys on me. Oh god, I'm going to die. Okay! Wow. Alright guys, well I'm going to kind of fast travel back to where I died. I'll see you guys in a second. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Alright, I'm back, and I just turned into human again. Alright, so I'm back, I grabbed my thing, and I have a, I have a little bit of stuff to talk about, uh, some... Oh god, that's why I did damage. Ethereum, why am I getting so lucky with these gems and runes? Like, seriously, I don't understand. But anyways, um, so I have a socketed ether rail item, and, uh, the beautiful thing about ether rail items is they break, but the even... What makes that beautiful is the fact that if you put them on your mercenary, they will not break, no matter what. So if you were wondering, how the hell am I supposed to use this other rail item that I, that'll just break if I use it? Like, what's the point? If you're wondering why or how, um, that's how, you know? So, uh, I picked up my body, I used the TP, I got an Ethereum. Wow. Wow. That's nice. I like that. I like that a lot. But seriously, I shouldn't be picking up Ethereans as luck as much as I am. I, I really don't understand that. Like they're supposed to be like insanely like rare. So that's that's a weird thing. Have extra keys. See, I just need to make sure I buy. Yeah, see, I don't need TP scrolls. What am I in here for? Right. I'm going to give this other rail item to my uh, thing majigger. I'm going to put something into it. I don't know what yet. So, let's see. Uh, 30 defense versus missiles. Uh, regenerate mana 15%. That's useless because mercenaries do not have mana. 
Uh, armor plus 15, light radius, don't really need that. 15% um, slower, man stamina drain, useless. Uh, 2 mana after each kill, useless. 15 slower. So the, pretty much the only thing that is worth putting in is... The defense room, but... I have a question for you guys because I don't know if this does this or not. I don't want to put in a uh, a topaz if I'm not going to get any benefit from it. Uh, you know, like um, finding magical items wise. So, in the comment section below, if you guys can help me out with this again, uh, that'd be really cool. I'm gonna wait to put any any anything into it be for that reason. Because uh, I don't want to give him a topaz if it's not going to help me get magical items. So if you guys can help me by letting me know if it does or does not, that would be really cool. Let's go back. See, dude, this, this act is so huge, so huge, that it takes up my entire screen. When I was walking into here, it took up my entire screen. I was able to look at the entire map. Just by, just by having this map up, I was able to see the entire map of uh, the spider... Forest. Combat Shrine. I do believe this. Holy shit! Two thousand eight hundred. What? What did it say? Two thousand eight hundred and two. Two thousand eight hundred and two attack rating, and I'm only hitting them ninety three percent of the time. That's crazy. Although I don't ever remember going above ninety, so above 90 must be a really hard thing to do so this is the one place I haven't gone I wanted to check this place out whenever I was walking back up here but I didn't want to move it out just I mean leave it out just in case there was something here but there isn't so I guess we can keep them going so almost level 22 I'm excited 24 I get my shockwave and I've realized that shockwave doesn't do that much damage but it is beautiful at, at 20 at level 20 shockwave stuns the enemies for 13 seconds that means that if you are being trampled, you can stun all of the enemies and take them out one by one. And that is a beautiful thing. That is why I'm going to put it into it. So I'm going to put about 10 of it. I'm going to put 10 of my skill points into it. But uh, but that'll, that'll be like later. Let's see, scroll of identify, don't need it. Chest. Armor rating. Defense. Dig it. My skin hardens. That's hot. Pick him another mana potion. Now I have two mana slots. Cracked antlers. Let's see what it what it gives me. Cyclone, Arctic Blast. Don't need it. Don't care. Pretty much all I want is the stuff that goes into uh, you know uh, shape shifting. I thought about putting into some of my fire uh, like like uh, fire things my fire skills because it will boost the uh, the amount of damage that fire claws gives me but I think I'm I think it I think what I have suffices I think it's good enough what's in here flyer jungle Is this lead to flyer jungle oh hey gloam I'm gonna call them gloam feel free to correct me if I'm wrong this I'm still in Great Marsh. I believe if I cross it, no, no, I'm still in Great Marsh. This is a huge area. I still have any. Oh, there's the waypoint. Probably should have taken the waypoint back to get some stamina potions. It's poison. It's poison. Yeah, I'm gonna take that back and get some stamina potions. Me having to press R and walk for a while. That's why I put stamina in my four slot. Get all this stuff identified. Don't have anything to identify. Got an Ormus. Make sure I can trade everything. Traded everything. Now we have to go all the way up to Alcor to get stuff. Yay! That is so fun. Let's see how much health do I have? 207. Trade. Just buy a crap load of stamina potions. 